In this Uber Suggest tutorial, I will show you how to run SEO audit, detailed and in-depth. Periodically, you need to keep monitoring the on-page and technical health of your website because this will always determine how well your website is doing. Needless to say that it will also affect your SEO and discoverability rating on searches. Also, Site Audit will show you what is working on your website, what is not working and the different aspects of your website that you need to fix or improve upon. In this video, I will show you how to conduct an in-depth site audit for your website using Ubersuggest. Actually, it is a very simple process as Ubersuggest does all the checks and presents you a detailed result of the current state of your website. Head over to Ubersuggest dashboard. If you don't have an account with Ubersuggest, just go to ubersuggest.com and sign up for a free account. On the Ubersuggest dashboard, come to the menu option and click Site Audit. I will be auditing a client's website that I created and have been managing for about 3 weeks now. So I will type in my website URL here. And I will make sure that the domain is selected here. I will search. Depending on the size of your website, you might have to wait for a few seconds or minutes as Uber suggests scan your site to present you your SEO audit report. Mine is a fairly small blog yet, so the audit will happen very fast. Let's quickly discuss some of the site audit report for this website. As you can see, this website has an on-page SEO score of 79 which is great. In the first two weeks, it records an organic traffic of 40, it can be improved upon surely. Organic keyword score of 87 and just in its first month, we have one backlink already. Uber suggests discovered 50 pages on this site which of course comprises of both static pages and post pages. Here you can see 39 issues discovered. 5 pages with low word counts is fine. You don't expect all pages of your website to have a lot of tests. 4 pages are blocked from appearing in search engines. You want to be sure why this happens because sometimes those pages have technical issues. Some other times you can be the one that either intentionally or non-intentionally blocks certain pages from appearing on searches. Again, 4 pages lack the h one a tag. Well, if that didn't come from you, you might also have to fix it. If you click the view details link in front of each issue, it will show you more details about these specific pages. Let's just take a look at this one. As you can see, these are not my regular pages, so that informs the reason why they have a load word count, which is very okay by me. You can export your results or download them for better review here. So let's return. You can do same for other pages where issues were discovered. Let's see all SEO issues. As you can see, Uber suggests as a tutorial on how you can fix each of these issues and it shows you the difficulty and SEO impact of each of them. If you are subscribed to this channel, I will be touching on each of these issues in later videos so you can fix anyone that relates to you. So you should subscribe to this channel for tips like this. This section shows you all the pages with excellent SEO rating. Like I said, I am satisfied with this website and its 2 week old result and also all my main pages and blog post pages all do well on the SEO rating. So I will return.
Okay, I believe this section is self-explanatory. It shows the load time for both desktop and mobile. The interactivity. The total time a page is blocked from responding to user input and visual stability. If I switch to the mobile score, you see that I need to carry out some optimization for my mobile. So that's how you check up on the site speed of your website on Ubersuggest Site Audit. Okay, so this is how you run a comprehensive site audit on Ubersuggest. And you should also be able to fix each of the issues as you see them in your site audit report. Please encourage this video by liking it. I will honestly appreciate you. Also, if you want simple WordPress blogging and marketing tips like this, then subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell so that you get notified each time I release a new video. Thank you and see you in my next video.